Ah, Jupiter Hell. It's good to be back. It's patch day. Best day ever. We are here with the Abattoir release. Patch number 1.8. And I'm going to do a patch note review, and then I'm going to play a game. So let's go. Patch notes. All right, so here we are. We're just going to walk through them one by one. Uh, 1354 new skill and kit uh, effects. Great. 1494 loot box models for Dante. Probably going to look more demonic and weird. That's cool. 1559 21 new medals in seven new net hex style conducts series. Oh dear. Oh, d I had thought I had climbed every mountain, and it appears that new mountains have, have sprung up. And unfortunately, I have not climbed every mountain. I still haven't done Angel of Mercy uh, diamond level, mainly because I just hate the challenge so much. Oh, it just feels so bad playing it. Ah, but whatever. We've got new ways to play and new crazy things to do, so we'll look at that. 1703. Cal Cal oh, Callisto. Callisto level 2 boon. Either T2 special chest or terminal procedure. Alright, so they've added something nice on C2. Okay. 1791. Japanese localization. Great. Doesn't matter. 1839. New Dante enemy. Frost Guardian. Um, look forward to meeting it and having having die in great numbers by my hand. 1843 accessibility option object outlines that's great I don't understand 1846 six new brand brand new exalted keywords this this is something that there's been a lot of talk on lately I'm very interested to see what this does um I had been work with uh, working with Ciobias, um on his uh, expanded pool of exalted keywords mod and it's one of those situations where um, I get exactly what I wanted and then I find out I hate it. <laughs> Probably why I, I don't really design video games, right? But um, one of the side effects of increasing the, the exalted keyword pool turned out that made Callisto a lot harder because the, the amount of keywords that can naturally spawn on formers was very limited before, and they weren't all that deadly. It's like it turns a guy into a chain gun guy. This is a good thing for you, because now you get chain gun and chain gun ammo. Or it takes turns a guy and turns him into a grenade launcher guy. This is good for you. You get grenade launcher and grenade launcher ammo. And if you change it to be something more effective, like warping around, or maybe more dodge, or maybe locks the, the eggs or something, that's fine and all, but it's also taking away the chain gun ammo and the grenade launcher ammo. So it generally makes the entire Inferno experience of Callisto harder. I'm not sure what these six new keywords will do and how they will expand this, but I am, I am happy I have been listened to a little bit. I am terrified that they've listened to me a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to find out anyway. 1859, 50, 58. Dante, five levels deep. Cool. Uh, more game is more better. And Dante has always been a little weird being so short. I hope it's going to be fun. 1859, Cal L1, new intro levels. Okay. Um, all right, not a problem. 1862, new Dante branch, the ossuary. All right, awesome. Um, I have nothing to comment there. I am intrigued. I will go there. I will probably die. Looking forward to it. New Dante Brand in, in 1863. New Dante Branch Special Abattoir. Uh, pairing up with 1864 Abattoir Boss. I am intrigued. I have no idea what this is. I'm going to go find, and I'm probably going to die like a dog. In Dante, no less, where the death hurts the very most of all. Thank you, Cornell. Thank you. 1871, new trial of the gauntlet. Oh, I'm already... This is, this is so far the best change of all. Very much looking forward to it. I have no idea what it is. Um, gauntlet. Um, 
Like, usually gauntlets are just hard trials, one after another, one after another, one after another. I have no idea what this means, but I'm all about it. Um, so I imagine it's going to be like Arena crossed with Endless, maybe? Arena crossed with a boss rush, maybe? Oh, wow, they haven't done that yet, have they? Like, imagine playing the arena, and it spawns a cryomancer, or two cryomancers on some levels. Yeah. Yeah, that would suck. I want to do that. All right, next. Change. No number. AWP capped at 100%. This is fine. I've never liked the AWP. Um, I understand its purpose in the world. I understand why everyone else likes it. It has just never been for me. Um... Like, the problem with the AWP is even when you get it up into God Gun stage, where it can remove any enemy on the map uh, with one shot, it's still only one enemy per unit time. Where I've always looked at that and said, yes, that's cute, but look what Gun Kata can do. Look what Gun Runner can do. Look what Onslaught can do. They can remove many enemies in more unit time. The overkill on the AWP is funny, but not the kind of funny that makes me want to go do it, you know? It's, it's, I am into a different sort of humor. And the gun being nerfed doesn't matter to me at all. Uh, another numberless fixed, FXAA only acted in highest shadow. No idea what this means, don't care. 15, 20, minor visual improvements in Dante. Perfect. 15, 70, Dante Inferno rewards. That's the Inferno branch, yes, not the difficulty. See, this one doesn't make a lot of sense to me, because I've always viewed Dante Inferno as not a place where you go to get power, but where you go to expend power as kind of a victory lap sort of thing. I mean, it's there to prove your character can do anything. Um, and if you can do Dante Inferno, the end boss is absolutely trivial for you, so... I'm not sure why it needs better rewards, because that's not the, the function the level served in my mind, but I've had no problem with that. Exalted Resist Split into Immune and Resist. Ah, yes, excellent. I, I was very much hoping this would happen. Um, resist, as it was, turns off too many things. I'm assuming that Resist is now like 20%. 25%, 50% resistance instead of immunity, which is what it used to be. Old resist was you are immune. I'm assuming immune is, is new resist, and new resist is something else. Anyway, resist good, immune bad. I'm glad there's two of these. Um, lethal and... Uh, oh, it's the same number. 1830. Lethal and deadly can no longer appear together. That's good! <laughs> that, that made for some... Very, very unfortunate situations. Like, I've lost so many games to Lethal, Deadly, whatever. It doesn't even matter at that point. But Lethal, Deadly, Medusa is the classic. Same number. Exalted Reaver and Fiend range weapons increased damage slash accuracy. I don't like that at all. I, I want the opposite of this. I want decreased damage and accuracy. Why are you doing this? Ah, well, whatever. Unstable removed from the non-exalted Inferno pool. This is an enormous change, and I love it. This single-handedly brings back melee builds on Inferno. Um, Inferno is a difficult enough mode as it is, but the fact that so many enemies would just take health on you when you killed them with melee is just absolutely destroyed the viability of melee builds. I tried very hard to get a thug-style vampire going, but never managed to take it very far. This is a, a wonderful change. I'm highly enthusiastic about that. I have to revisit, especially I think since I thought, thought that Assassinate was uh, on the cusp of being Inferno viable. This hopefully will push it all the way into being Inferno viable. Anyway, here we go. This is what's been rumored for a long time. Shotgun buffs, 1831. All shotguns apply slowdown for a second and a half. All, most shotguns now have reduced swap time. This is very big. 
All right, so what was the problem with shotguns before? Uh, they were slow. The problem is the grenade launchers, essentially. Grenade launchers do everything the shotguns are good at it, and they're they're much, much better at it. They're supposed to be balanced by having uh, scarcity of ammo, but uh, Scavenger, um, Army Surplus to a lesser extent, and to a greater extent Inferno mods in the old style game made that you would always have the ammo that you wanted. So you, the, the only downside of the grenade launcher was out. And there's supposed to be another gr downside with grenade launcher where it's, it's got a little bit of scatter on the shot, but with a little intelligence that doesn't matter at all. So you, you were always faced with the problem is, do I take the grenade launcher with me or do I take the shotgun with me? You don't generally have an option for both because it's just you don't have enough uh, weapon slots, so you have to pick one. Um, and the shotgun was just never, ever, ever working out because it's slow to bring out, uh, it does crap damage at range, and if you happen to get yourself into a range situation, well, it's not going to help you very much. Um, it's got a natural enemy in that it has it does slash damage, and if you try to do slash damage to a robot, you're going to have a real bad time. So there's a lot of downsides to the shotgun, and it just all added up to what I felt was just a gun not even worth looking at, ever. Just ever. Um... And then someone posted a a 100% Inferno clear with a Gunrunner Scout using shotguns, making me think I have to go through and reevaluate everything I had ever known about the gun. But anyway, it's all changed anyway, so I have a, an excuse. I wasn't wrong, they just changed the game. That's how it goes. But anyway, let's... Problem one with shotguns. Slow to come out. Hey, look, it's now faster, and you get a swap harness on there, it's probably essentially instant. That's excellent. Um, this means that if you open a door and a giant ball of pain is on the other side, you get a chance to quick draw the shotgun and fire it. It's a safe weapon to have in the holster instead of in your hand at the all, all times. That's good. Really like that. All shotguns apply slow down, which doesn't affect firing speed, but affects movement speed for long enough to reload and fire again. This is, I think, enormous. For one thing, I think it means the shotgun will just mulch fiends. If you have a fiend coming at you and you have a shotgun, you have no problems whatsoever in the world. Um, Reavers are kind of like a bit more of a problem, and then it falls apart when you get into, like, uh, Cryboros and you get into um, Cryo Reavers. So this is like... Because it, it doesn't affect attack speed, just move speed. So only when they're coming at you. And so it's probably completely irrelevant at range, unless you pull up the shotgun and use it to, like, cover your retreat. Which is an interesting kind of uh, interaction. But but I'm getting off track. I'm especially looking at to see if this is going to be applicable onto an auto shotgun. Like, if you can whip out an auto shotgun and it still has the slowdown with a focus shotgun um, and be able to bam, bam, bam right off the bat with that, that will be a very powerful weapon. But I have to... See, to be continued. More later. Uh, 1847. Scouts now start with three weapons. Absolutely required, in my opinion. I had gotten... I, I hated playing scouts because of the two-weapon limit. There are... It's suffocating. It really is. Just the nature of the game is you tend to want to have a long-range weapon and a close-range weapon. And if you were playing a scout... This, this means you have all your weapon slots filled. You are now done. There's no room for a, a, a weapon you have ambitions of upgrading. There's no room for a utility weapon. There's no room for carry a other damage type or, a, or exotic or unique you found that might be useful in certain situations. So your, your, your core weapons were always 100% filled. And so you never had any chance for niche. And God help you if you went dual gunner. That just means you are pistol locked forever and you must, must, must um, 
uh, keep it going. And if it ever falters, you're just done. And it's RNG based, and I hate it. So I'd always end up taking Hoarder simply to get the, the, the gun slot. And it's like, Scouts, the class where you lose a trait in order to actually play it. And it felt terrible. Um, I believe one of the exalted traits that are coming around is adaptive, which mandates you juggle between damage types, which would crush scouts if uh, they were still if they happened to be caught with two impacts in both hands or uh, shotgun and a slash. But apparently, this appears not to be the case anymore because scouts now have the, the extra slot they join the technician and the marine this is fantastic I look forward to playing scouts again with a little less dread um, next up uh, in the same change visibility of Dante crates improve for less bumping I have lost games to bumping into Dante crates I'm not sure why this shares a change with Scout visibility, scout weapons, but whatever. 1850, minor improvements to Callisto level generators. Awesome. Fixes. Carnage found bullet count. This isn't even a sentence. Fixed deadly precision abbreviation. Great. Fixed off screen emitters being shortly visible at creation. I've probably used this, right? I think I have. Anyway, we'll see. It's like, is this also going to cover the, the green um, aura of uniques being on the ground? Like, um, in vaults and stuff? Uh, Alright, well, we'll find out. Fixed rendering of tiled textures. Great. Fixed supply proto mix-up in one Asterius Breach version. Yes, I have done this before. Yes, it was mixed up. I am glad it is fixed. Uh, fixed potential crash steam deck, great. 1825, prevent stage 3 boss from flying away too far. It's happened to all of us at least once. 1830, fix exalted fiends, ravager with double ra Oh, they stopped the double ball. Oh, ravagers and fiends would occasionally double ball at you, which is like default double damage on top of everything else that they're doing. This might go a long way to defang the, um, quad cryo one arch reaver pack that happens in Europa. Um, it's one of the big problems with arch reavers is that they would double ball you and uh, they could do that with cold and acid which does terrible things to you in your life. Hopefully this makes that a lot better. Uh, 1866 watcher effects will trigger even if the watcher can't take action. Interesting. I know I've 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 been so fast that I've killed the watcher like the pyro watcher before it could see me and set me on fire. I wonder if this covers that use case. We'll have to say same number watchers won't watch themselves. All right, useful. 1877 fixed languages when multiplying in mod mode from multiplying multiplying mod mode seems useful for people who aren't me. 1878 fixed menu keys from being stuck in a loop. I don't know what that means. It's probably happened to me and I've already lost that memory because my brain is now Swiss cheese. But that's, that's a lot of stuff. Best thing, probably shotguns. No, scouts. Oh god. That makes a whole class non-painful for me to play. Shotguns, great. Mod pool, great. Keyword changes, great. Uh, RIP, AWP, extra levels, extra stuff, extra everything. I'm in. Let's play. Oh, and the gauntlet. Oh, do I play the gauntlet right now? No, not right now. No, later. I'll play the gauntlet later. Right now, um, we are going to test shotguns. And what this means is new game, challenge modes. No. New game. Trial. Gauntlet. Oh, let's look. Face the gauntlet trial and see how deep you can go in a special no-frills deep dive. The seed is the same for everyone in the world. So you can compare your progress. Seed changes on Mondays. No branches. No special levels. 
No mini levels. No cap on the amount of unique spawn. Difficulty is set to ultra violence, but gets worse. Amount of levels is 100, but difficulty will get insane real fast. Okay. 100% in on this. We'll, we'll we'll be back. No, no, trust me. We'll we'll be back. This is going to be a Monday thing for me. Well, not this Monday, but Monday's coming up. But the seed is the same. The game changes. Oh, this used to be a thing I wanted to do. Like I used to do um, civilization runs online back back in a while ago. And one of the things I used to want to get going but never could was like, all right, everybody, we play on the same map using the same settings and the same uh, starting point and the same uh, leader and the same sieve. And we're going to see how far we can, who can get the fastest win first and try to maximize exactly one situation. It's going to be weird playing games where I actually know what's coming because the seed doesn't change. You can play the map again and again and again and just kind of... Uh, Zerg rush it, like, um, Meat Boy style. That's interesting. There's gonna be people that wouldn't, that clear all 100 levels every week, aren't they? It really depends on how fast the difficulty ramps up, though. Like, but, but foreknowledge is so very important. Like, like, even if there's just a, a just an utter hell wall level on level, like, 25, maybe, you can play a scout and, like, try to get enough stealth to just get enough steps to get through it to get to 26. It's like a tower defense sort of thing at this point. Um, that's really, really interesting. I have to think about that. Anyway, not now. Uh, thinking hard, don't want to. We're going to just play Nightmare because everything is new, and marine, and we're going to do uh, Army of Darkness. We're going to play a straight-up um, shotgun-focused game, and we're going to see how the new shotguns are. This is my plan. Okay, so let's take a look around first and make sure I know what I'm doing. It is not often that I know what I'm doing. We're going to do Army of Darkness, Furious and Reloadal. Problem like demerit of the mastery, furious and reloader both kind of suck. Uh, one of the things that makes a mastery good or not is the uh, the strength or weakness of its uh, run up. Oh hi! Oh, just gonna come see me, eh? Oof. So we're having a party right here, huh? Oh, we absolutely are. Alright, so. I'm out of ammo. That guy's got a revolver. Right there. And now we step up. Oh, he actually hit me from behind the wall. Ugh. Right, this is actually just fine. The important thing right now is there's our shotgun. I'm at slowdown on me. Look at that. Slowdown. So I should not move. Oh wow, that will just butcher you if you try to move after you've been shot. So everybody's here, right? Which is okay because uh, I'm here too. I watch the corpses, they can't hurt me. <laughs> Lucky. Alright, let's get out of here. We gotta get our shotgun. Why isn't that bot attacking me? Anyway, we're gonna be a uh, shotgun guy, so reload. Okay, auto rifle, go away. Shotgun, right there. I might have to get army surplus, right? I get out of here with full health. So that was a new layout. And it's just fine. I feel like the icons are a little sharper and harsher. Maybe I'm zoomed in a little bit here? Maybe. Alright, let's keep going. Shotgun guy on the board. 
Not a good layout for a shotgun guy. Probably have to play aggressive. Okay. So... And then look at it. It does not appear to be affected by the slowdown. Which is okay, it's not really what you'd expect. Watch your XP. How did that guy take so many bullets? Yeah, okay, disgusting, but fast reload. Good. Pop. Good. Yeah, I seem to remember uh, the Angel of Shotgunnery Challenge. Could go to the mines. Hey, if you really want to test to see if your shotgun game is as good as you think it is, go to the mines. This should mulch fiends. As I said before, oh, L3 is just right there. This is a different look. Help me, Jesus. Uh, okay. It's important to have a ranged weapon. Your shotgun usually isn't it. Like, it's another shotgun demerit. Where are the enemies? So he's got slowdown. Oh, hello. Shotgun heaven, right here. Nice. See, they're moving, and they're all slow. Alright, we've killed actual people. Emergency supply dot. Drop. Oh, I get to pick? I wonder if this red key card... Uh... Oh, you get to get a multi-tool on level 2, guaranteed. Wow. That helps so much. Um, that helps so much. There's been so many times I've been locked out of somewhere and just had a little, had a little fit, not gonna lie, had a little, oh, quick blade? In a storage room? In the mines? Nice. Medical facility on L6, but I have to, fortunately, be to L5 to there. To repair. So what does a Army of Darkness guy want? Quick blade and then try to get a chainsaw? Army of Darkness begs, begs, begs for um, a chainsaw. Um, so I guess what do I do? Do I go to the mines? Yeah, we're going to go to the mines. All right, so the mines are in a storage room, which is wonderful. The mines are here. And there's one sentry left. The emergency supply drop should be then... Always have a multi-tool? Extra stim pack? Wow, this is a choice. It's the multi-tool or the stim pack. Well, I'm a marine. Marines tend to be just fine when it comes to health. Ugh. All right. So sweep this room. Go get whatever that is. Calibrate ambush is a wonderful gun. I feel like all the graphics are just a little bit harsher than they usually are. Auto repair is wonderful. Did you just hit me? No, he didn't. Alright, so now we're looking at one of the problems with the shotgun, and that. Ammo does become an issue. 
All right, we're gonna do the mines, but with no Hellrunner and a shotgun. This is a, such a bad idea. <laughs> and the hunt. Oh my god. Oh, this is so dumb. Help me. It's so dumb. I'm being dumb. Help. Help. Being dumb. Fiends. Alright, we gotta find defenses. And we have to watch the bodies. This is a terrible position. Oh no! Um... Oh, I knew he was gonna... I was greedy there. Uh, I'm gonna heal myself right now. I was greedy and I tried to get the experience. And I ought not have done that thing. Okay, as expected, this is just utterly destroying fiends. Go exactly to, no, go to Hellrunner. Because, uh, I'm in the mines. It's definitely the correct branch for this. The problem is, I went the wrong way. And I'm going to have to deal with all these corpses. Because I have to come back directly here. Uh, Jovasek or auto repair? Probably auto repair. This is definitely better. It's so strange to me, I'm not picking up the. Uh... Uh, the grenade launcher. At least I'm splattering these guys. Why isn't... Oh, winning the hunt's gonna be so hard. Because, uh, it's nightmare. We're gonna do it. <laughs> hey. At least that guy's not coming back. Tainted Hunter. Shotgun does have its charms. I'm going to have to get Army Surplus. <sighs> Gotta go. Alright, we finally got dots. Getting them all down is going to be very hard. Really? I'm playing badly here. Now we've got respawns. Oh no, burning seven. Help me. Ah, oh. problems. So many problems. All of this is dumb. I'm being dumb. Good. Corrosive, what are you? He's a trail of acid, spawns acid pools in the vicinity. 
At least I'm taking them out. Not that guy for some reason. So this is again very dumb. Oh, I should have looked at what Resist did. I gotta dive for this guy. Yeah! Alright, so what am I doing? What's my plan? Furious is so weak. Um, I guess I get Hellrunner level 2 because I'm in the mines. Dare I go for that uh, chest? I mean, we all know the. Oh, there's a station over there, too. Mag pistol's pretty good. That could solve problems. Oh. Doesn't do anything. Alright. I don't know why I have the mag pistol. I mean, it's for bots. Only bots aren't really a problem in the mines. Ah, oh, well, whatever. I'm way low on ammunition for uh, the shotgun. But I'm a little faster. This is such a bad plan. So if I'm slowing that reaver enough... Okay. That wasn't bad, but it didn't splatter him. Splatter them both. Good. So, okay, I gotta go there. Probably go there right now. Oh, hello, friends. Alright, this was an improved experience to what I'm used to. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Maybe I pushed that a little too far. Oh, this works really well on these guys. What are you? Power mod? Alright, fortunately I'm kind of beat up. I've got so many exalted reavers coming at me. Oh, he's got a grenade launcher. That's no good. This is a terrible place to play catch with grenade launchers. Alright, so I'm going to have to... Um, what is the solution to this situation? Fall back on the mag pistol? Huh. This is too little damage. I have to take him at range. Okay. Fortunately, shotgun purity broken. But I did survive that, so can't complain too much, right? Pistol amp? I mean, I got a pistol, right? Auto med and furious. There's my quick blade. Yeah. That's going to be used. Why is it I can't find shotgun ammo now? 
the graphics seem a little harsher on all this, like more pixelated. Not sure what that is about, or if I'm just uh, hallucinating it. Anyway, uh, Army of Darkness, keep going. Um, we have found the special room. Good. We have opened the vault. I like how I'm not hating my life the second I see a Reaver and have a shotgun out. The shotgun is now working against Reavers. Um, but I'm unsure how much to attribute to the shotgun buff as opposed to the fact that, uh, yeah, sure. Uh, I have Reloader. I should probably read. I just played a game that's all about reading, and yet I cannot read. I feel like the game has been very generous with, uh, uh, Grenade launcher ammo. Oh, that's resilient? That sucks for them. I have the gun to deal with these guys. That feels good. Nice. Where's the way down? Right over there? Command visor. That's wonderful. Okay, can I just sneak out of here? Should be a trail of just 50 Reavers coming at me. Yep. Can't get them both? That feels different. Bye. Alright, got out right in the nick of time. Quick pause. And back. Alright, so I got a dash like mad. This is gonna be really tricky, isn't it? This is kinda not gonna happen, is it? So want that rocket guy to do something. Oh, and there's more. Twenty one seconds. Allowing myself to be set on fire. Gotta go if I'm going. <laughs> this is such a bad idea. I like the stim pack effects. Five seconds. Only shotgun could have done that. So, I paid quite a lot to do this, and it was only for the anomaly, which is unfortunate. Uh, heal me. Yeah, I see those. Give me a med kit. I am in exactly the kind of shape I expected from Army of Darkness. How about that? Um, my armor is almost shredded. I've made an enormous mess right here. There's the anomaly. Which I should probably just go do, right? The 
anomaly, the hardest of all of them. Um, I have. I gotta use the mod pack. Uh, that will be used. This is gonna be tough. This is gonna be really tough. Watch me find a super shotgun and wish I just had the uh. uh Reaver's Claw. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, already right there. Oh, that was the worst thing that could have happened. <sighs> that was awful. Immediately flanking in that exact position. This is okay. Combination of the bleed and I should probably use a med kit. Oh, bad again. Time to go. Ah, they're just snipers. Okay, in terrible shape. I suppose I do have to worry about them respawning behind me, don't I? So I have to play a little aggressive. Ugh, just snipers. Actually did it. Nice. Deagle. No, I want the anti-bot gun. Fiend's head. Fiend's head is wonderful. Fiend's head is better than bloody tears. You shotgun? <laughs> Immediately wish I had the uh, uh, the ripper back. What's going on here? It's even better ripper. Oh, it's an auto shotgun. So it's a little less damage, but only just a little. All right, you're coming with me. A shotgun amp. What do you do? Speed loader is wonderful. And extra crit damage. And this is already more crit chance with an amp for more crit damage. All right. So it's double damage on crit. And of course, the, the relic here is the Warlock's Horn. That is not worth it, in my opinion. It's time to get out of here. I'm going to use adrenaline and go. I'm going to have to get army surplus very soon. Alright, so, doing alright. New gun. I haven't used my quick blade yet. Hopefully I'll do that someday. Where's the way down, he asks. I'm really uncomfortable about lots of stuff. Fiends. I like fiends. try to make it to that medical station, right? Though it's always a tricky, tricky proposition on this difficulty. Oh 
man. I want to heal up, but I don't think I'm going to be able to get there. Like, I kind of have to now, right? Every time you retreat, you lose ground, which is, I guess, what retreating is, right? Good job. Goal sighted. This is probably the perfect situation for this gun. At least I still heal off. Uh... All right, so. <sighs> so I fought all this way just to get that medcat kit back, right? All right. That was probably not the best choice. That's the way down. They're just fiends. Another deagle. A really good deagle. Is this it? This is it. It's time to go. Could have done a great uh, dual gunner, a great bolt storm game based off this, but no. Anyway, made it through the mines. That's always impressive. All right, remember, whip out a pistol when it comes time. I guess I didn't need that when uh, I'm going to be Army of Darkness here in a second. Really? A terrible position, because I know there's a rocket launcher guy right there. Alright. Beep. Beep. I can make it through this. I can do it. I do one damage, but I apply slowdown. Alright, so now Army of Darkness. Slash weapons and impact launchers that get converted to pierce damage. Soft to melee weapons instantaneously. So I guess I don't really need the, uh, the pierciness on that anymore. I'm going to have to get army surplus. I need armor of any kind. Oh yeah, just remember, nightmare. Gotta be very efficient with how I move. Ah, fiend's head! Shotguns are working. I can't say they're tremendously wonderful. Am I using the aim assist in order to uh, crit them more? I suppose this is also a bad difficulty to be playing this challenge on. Shotguns benefit so much from boogeyman tactics, which are necessar necessarily slow. Alright, so this is a horrible position, right? But one we are able to navigate fairly well. What are you? Molten long shot? It's okay. Okay, this long corridor is going to be a gigantic pain. Got them both. Pl 
playing a little aggressively right now. Oh, beautiful. Um, charge, medkit, medkit. Obviously the right thing to do, I think. And then I finish this branch with this, uh, this side of the level. I am 100% going to need uh, army surplus. Good. Ouch. Now I sweep towards the exit. Yeah, army surplus needs to be prioritized. Oh, we got dots. Nice. We're gonna leave with overhealth. Also nice. This is one of those situations where I wish I could have scavenger on uh, the marine, even though army surplus is definitely better. Okay. Good. Need armor at some point. Ugh, need not this situation. See, it's not splatternum, which is a problem. So I like splatternum. Now my plan had been to go into melee alongside this. Maybe huge fury health regeneration combo. I don't think that's going to be how it goes. Really enjoying the crit on this thing. Wish it was more reliable. Suppose it wouldn't be a crit then, it would simply be a hit. Really difficult terrain for me. Where are all my shotgun guys at? Feels good. That was a waste. I gotta keep moving. I'm getting really slowed down. I'm so low on ammo. Ammo, the curse of the game. Wow. Well, got fooled by the, uh, I shouldn't have done that, because those guys are going to come back to life for fighting Warden. It's no good. So, so I should go heavy into shotgun crit, huh? Oh, nice. Lottery win. This is where we hit him with the slow. And we just go away. What's resist do? 50% resistance of all status effects. Two points of innate armor. Alright, so this doesn't turn off Fire Angel. Which was my big problem with it. So. Uh, we are reaching one of the problems. Oh no. Keep the uh, attack computer. Need armor. Not whatever that is. So this is going to be a Pierce rocket launcher, huh? <sighs> so hard to go into rocket launchers when I'm so low on ammo.
Maybe later. Even though right now is clearly the best time for it. It's only going to get worse. Alright. Time to get out the pistol, which I brought all this way specifically for this fight. It's time to see if this has been updated at all. Pop. Has the warden gotten savvy to all my hacks and cheats? Pistol just feels so much better, unfortunately. What kind of world do we live in? Ugh. Still no shotgun shells. This is going to be a theme going forward, isn't it? Yeah. So army surplus, a flat out requirement by this build. Don't like that at all. Anyway, let's keep going. See, it's just, it's why army of darkness is so just weak. The traits you have to take to get it online are hard. It's necessitating I take ammo perks just to make it work, which is, again, not what you want. You want your, your, your mastery to do things, not have to align your entire build to just make it function, and to have ammo for the gun. Ah, oh, no shotgun shells. I shouldn't have opened that. I should have leveled and then used that to get more shotgun shells. Oh, hello. It will fight you right here, next to the barrel. What? That could have gone a lot better. So it's going to necessitate two levels of this just to run the mastery, so it might as well be extra requirements on it. Uh, like I said, not great. Out of ammo. And now I have to fall back on a pistol and a quick blade? I got problems, don't I? Um, is there anything I can do about this? I, am I just going to get armor here? Am I actually in pretty bad shape right now? Like, is the machete better than the quick blade for me? Simply because of, uh... Well, I don't have double damage on it. An AV1 machete, is that what I need to survive what's coming? Ugh. Well, this is a terrible position. Quick blade does... a ton of damage. When it comes out, and it comes out instantaneously. So I guess I keep it right. This feels wrong, the marine armor. But that's what I'm doing. Compartments is always nice. Shotgun shells? No. No shotgun shells. There we go. Officially out of ammo on the shotgun. That is painful. Really painful. Why did I pick that up? I don't have anything that shoots that. I don't have any of that either. 
So I'm just a pistol guy now. Oh, terrible. Absolutely terrible. Can go to the bio labs. Can I go to the bio labs? I've got five multi tools. Maybe go to the bio labs. Oh, bio labs with uh, uh, nightmare. Oh no, that would be terrible. Do I do it? The ruins are on the supply drop on the ruins. The ruins is real good. I think we probably go to the ruins. The ruins is my favorite out of all of them. Oh no. this. I am thrilled by the fiend's head though. That guy's gonna get back up. Did he double ball? Well, I'm being pounded. I wish I had a shotgun so I could use my mastery. How I wish I had a shotgun to use my mastery. And keep in mind the other aspects of it also turn off. Might not find a chainsaw, so the whole chainsaw buff is useless. Should I be using a hunting rifle right now? Should I do this? Oh, hi. I miss. There's more of them, and they're getting up too. Oh, how I wish I could use my mastery. Things are going to start getting up behind me and I'm going to be in trouble. I've got to start moving. I can't afford to be playing slow like this. Uh, none of this means much to me. I'm going to go to the ruins, right? Or do I go to the bio labs? I don't have ammo. Why would I go to the bio labs if I didn't have ammo? Um, auto calibrate that, I guess. Uh, charge, create mod pack. Probably a power pack. I should have a plan here, but I don't. For the weapon, I don't shoot. Well, that wasn't good at all. Rocket launcher. See, I can't really pick it up. I don't. I would love to use the rocket launcher, but I don't have the uh, uh, the hands for it. It's the problem with the game. There are. I have to pass on more opportunities than I can take. Oh, Duramesh scout armor. Oh yeah. Um, oh yeah, definitely. There's our drain. We might just be leaving. Again, no, uh, I should probably be using a chain gun. Especially since it throws itself at me with such gusto right here. Of course, right now is exactly when I wish I had that pistol in my hand again. This is death right here. 
trying to go back up that corridor is going to be death. I see a cloud. It's time to go. It is time to go. That is an exalt with some sort of cloud based attack and I want no part of it. Or I'm going to the ruins. All of this is really unfortunate. Again, my mastery is disabled right now because of just RNG. You must get army surplus. I, I very much wish the requirements for uh, Army of Darkness involved army surplus. I shouldn't have gone Hellrunner even though I went to the mines. We're going to take this. Wait a second. Why did you drop a ball? Was the, uh... The pack nerfed? Now it is no longer... Oh, crap. Oh, problems. Uh, quick blade. Adrenaline. Murder that. Yeah. Okay. That was a situation where I easily could have died. But I managed to navigate it. Bulk mod on Duramesh for fire resistant, maybe? That's never a bad idea. Fire gets to you. I only have one slot for it. Oh, did I give up my shotgun? I had to, because I had no... Wait. Wait. No, the shotgun's right there. Okay, good. Still, no. Um, bulk mod on Dermash. This has to be on here, right? Close, tight levels. Yeah, but that Cryo Reaver dropped a uh, health orb. Now I wish I could use my mastery. And you usually only saw uh, that drop uh, when it was the quad reaver pack with uh, three cryo reavers and one arch reaver. But that, if that has been nerfed so that it is now a cryo reaver and three fiends. That takes a hell of a lot of bite out of E3, E1. So I think I'm seeing it again right here. And again, I would like to just say I very much wish I could use my mastery. Uh, I am 100% in ammo trouble. I need that next level of army surplus. Or else I'm going to be melee only here in a second. And the problem is, I can be doing, like, tricks. Uh, boogeyman tactics in order to uh, steal kills with melee. But those are all slow. Oh, this is terrible right here. Extended mag's alright. I'm almost out of ammo entirely.
even all these gun switches are a problem. Oh, finally, that guy's got a shotgun. Okay. Uh, do I want a dual shotgun? Uh, if I could mod the range, I guess. I don't know what I'm doing. That's, that's a very... <laughs> oh, adaptive. Adaptive. Rising resistance against attack damage type. Now it's 40% to pierce. Now it's 90% to pierce. Could have gone sideways, I'd say. But I am being too greedy. I don't think I'm doing a good build at all right now. But I do know I finally got another rank of army surplus. Notice how there were... Oh, finally I I find a ammo box. Alright. Ugh. Now I have to go be greedy. By which I mean I have to go get that ammo, that box I left because I was waiting to level up army surplus again. Which means I get more of that, and more of that, and generally more. I get more. Remember I have a smoke grenade, so this was brutal. This level stomped my face. I really wish I could take that dual shotgun. Um, what would I do with it? Get rid of the chain gun? I can't. Well... I have army surplus 2 now. Oh, it takes one full second to bring out the dual shotgun. I'm not sure that's good. Probably should have gone to the military barracks and tried to get a super shotgun. Eh, well. Rush him. Okay. Hunter Adaptive Ice. How am I going to deal with... Oh, I only do one damage type. And that's Pierce. Uh-oh. So I better make it hurt, right? Uh, I will say this, that did affect my decisions, so I feel like it should be on um, Calibrate a Shotgun, I also feel like I should just take it with me. Okay, Europa Concourse is where a lot of games end, so I gotta be careful. Good. Oh yeah, more shotgun now. Um, I'm way overweight on health. I hear all sorts of terrible things. There's more right there. I guess take the vault first, I suppose. I want to take it up right here. I guess I should find the drain. So I found the one side that doesn't have a drain on it. Fiend's head doing so much work. Get the smoke out. I should have just shot him.
Use the smoke. Oh, this is powerful. This is filthy. And if they happen to get close, uh, I have a uh, Alpha Strike gun for them. Cryo Watcher. That was nice. Reloader and spread control. What do we have here? Critical damage and faster? I don't know if that's going to work out. I have to feel like I, I feel like I need to come up with a damage plan. I feel like it's a problem I don't have one already. This is nice. It's exactly what you want to see in life. Important part is it gives them all. So there's the actual exit. So I'm doing this correctly, sweeping in the right direction. Because I want to take the elevator to the ruins. Oh. Looks like I have a shot of full clearing the level. Doesn't always happen. More. <sighs> Go down on health. The smoke grenade and the shotgun is such a combo. I guess I'm just overweight on health, and I have to admit that. Um, and then here, I guess we just increase my health. Do I have anything I can stack? Get another med kit, but I'm still overweight on health. Yeah, increase my health. This has its own charm to it. It's not a fish. Ooh, what are you? Elephant gut? What are you? You instantly have my attention. Frag shotgun. That's actually really good, isn't it? Like, exceptionally good. Um. It does pierce. 70 pierce is a lot of pierce. And frenzy is great. And shots cause bleed. But I have to get 9mm. That's not common. Can I put the accuracy mod on this? Or calibrated? That probably means something right there. Alright, that's fine. I don't know if there's any ammunition for this on the level. Just asking that question is probably the wrong one. Time to go. Just go. Just get out of here. Nightmare level. Nightmare level. Uh, okay. Good. To the ruins. This is not a good start. This is a lot of problems associated with it. So blasting the cryo reavers like that. All right, this is a real, real problem. I have to go here, get hit, adrenaline, quick blade, murder that thing. Back to this gun. Load it. Load it. Load it. Wait. Okay, that's what's known as a bad start to the level. Oh, I probably should have gotten frag shotgun ammo. We can do that here. Alright, let's see how this performs. Um, as I recall, the frag shotgun is somewhat of a beast. It doesn't take much to reload this, does it? I do realize these are 
just fiends. There's the test right there. All right, that felt good. Frenzy is helping a lot right there. Um, we're probably doing the same thing, increasing health, but I have to come back here. So just now, just do it now. Oh, I probably should have uh, not modded that with what I did. Instead, try to mod it with uh, hallowed. This isn't peak. It's a terrible place to have a shotgun fight. Okay. I have... Did I just one-shot that thing? That had to have been a crit. It's a brutal level. Alright, level 9. <sighs> what am I doing? I can get running? Running's beautiful. AMF? No, that's a trap. Rip and tear and go into melee? Tempting. Uh, Hellrunner again? Always good. Especially on a... Uh, Stained Fire is not what I want. Gunslinger, Bloodhound, Field Medic, Wizkid... Huh. Oh. I guess I shouldn't have messed with the optimal ranges at all, given that it's going to be... I'll get boosts later. I don't know how to play this. My, my entire problem is I don't know how to play the game. Um... Two Ranks Reloader has purpose. But I think I think we're gonna have to go into rip and tear. Rip and tear has a lot of utility beyond um, just the obvious. Um, use it. Just use it on the ground. What we get? No, oh, not worth taking. I'm so overweight on health. Oop. This is about when I wish I got one more rank Hellrunner. Well, that was just not the proper way to handle the situation. How's that guy bleeding? Am I actually off screening? Pretty badass if I am. I'm having a lot of trouble at range, which is, you know, shotgun. This is greed. Greed is here. I'm gonna have to take this fight right now. Read in action. Oh, I didn't blow him up. And there was actually. Well, there's this stuff down here. There's some XP right there. Yes, I refer to you as EXP. That's all you are. Now we hit this. Uh, charge, heal, off we go. Yeah, I'm not sure about the frag shotgun and its role in the future. I do not like seeing the exit right there. Ancient Sigil, terrible. Oh, hi.
So this is going to be a real pain, isn't it? Uh, immediate emergency protocol activated. Got too close. I keep relying on Frenzy to do damage, but it's just not good enough with the shotgun like it is. It will get much better with further levels of Army of Darkness, but it's not there yet. This is a little dangerous for me. Oh, alright. Back to this. For experience? Yeah, I don't really need these. Okay. I will do the temple, I think. And I will take a break. And I will finish this another time. You won't notice though. I'll leave you right there. Yeah. Let's do this. Good, good. I'm really enjoying that. <laughs> I'm not sure that the way I'm doing things is better or not. You know? I think maybe the normal shotgun might be better. Gas mask is good. Better than red access? Mm. Mm. I don't even have a red keycard if I have red access. That's a good question, isn't it? This is just all sorts of bad. It's a long way. This gun is definitely better. But better enough? Question mark? Oh. Okay. Both those things were my fault. Hello first actual challenge of the game. How do I deal with that? Like... How do I deal with this? I do... 35 damage. I don't have a good answer to the Medusa. Run in and quick blade it? How much health do you have? Can I do that? Is that even a good idea? I think I missed? Well, this won't blow them up. And this, this won't blow it up either. Oh. Well, farewell health. I should have pricked it beforehand, I suppose. Oh well. So, doing okay-ish. Wish I hadn't gotten bitten. That's yeah, fine. And pick up you. Load. Frag shotgun is definitely superior shotgun. The mephitic keyword doesn't seem that impactful. Which I suppose I should be grateful for, right? Army surplus 2 is so good.
The Best of the Ammunition Skills by a good margin. Oh, I need another rank of Hellrider. <laughs> Should get another rank of Army of Darkness real soon here. Alright, there's the temple. So I might as well go do that now, right? Nice. He says he wanders away from it without a plan. So it looks like I have to do the temple and then duck immediately south. Okay, let's do it. This place is old. Very old. Wicked old. And it's always harder on Nightmare. Not impossible by any means. Thanks to change a couple paths we got patches ago. You didn't have to kill them all, you just had to kill enough of them, you know? This was a bad idea. I'm trying to splatter them. Yeah, plasma shotgun. Plasma shotguns feel wrong uh, in that they don't have enough punch to them. A shotgun should make you feel it with the sound and what people, what the enemies do. And plasma shotguns are just way on the weak end of that. Blowing up a cryo reaver, always good. Probably could have done that a lot better, but I'll see if I can get enough damage to blow them up. I could not. Duramesh armor is doing so much for me too. It's one of those items I always just smile whenever I see. Makes my day every single time. I hope I find a chainsaw. Alright, level 10, Army of Darkness again. Uh, extra optimal range on everything to the show. Does. We'll see what the temple gives me. If it gives me the hallowed mod, I must take it for a plasma shotgun. Even though plasma shotguns don't get converted to pierce, which I suppose is okay all on its own. Just so long as I'm aware of it. So I should keep a dogs. Don't like dogs. That guy double ball. I always watch out for that. There we go. I'm gonna run out of ammo for the frag shotgun, but that's all right. Now we go round two with everybody. Salted Ravagers. Thank you. I do feel like I'm worthy. Sneak our way in. Sneaky, sneaky. Loot this place. Looty, looty. What we got? Yeah, maybe. Uh, shotgun booster is exactly what I want, right? Just straight damage for shotgun. Do I take the heart? Probably take the heart. Capacitor matrix? What, what do you do? 
Oh, absolutely not. Even though that really, that combo's hard. Wow, trash. So I guess I take the, the heart and then maybe the other thing. Damn. Is this gonna piss him off? All right, it's not gonna piss him off enough. The ancient heart elixir. Yeah. All right. Time to go. Ouch. Uh, the capacitor matrix combined with fury generation happening all the time off of uh, rip and tear. That has the potential to be very nice. Uh, you know, constant healing. Good. Alright. We made our point. No, I mean, it gave me the, the shotgun amp. Um, which is probably for the best. I don't know. I'm going to have to take a break here. I'm going to save and quit. And I'm going to pause. And hopefully none of you will notice. I'll be right back. Bye. All right, right back at it. How long has it been? You'll never know. Let's keep going. So as I recall, I just got done with the ruins in the Frozen Temple. All I got out of it was a pretty good shotgun booster. Um, didn't find the Hallowed mod, and I am carrying the Frozen Heart, which is good for the cryomancer fight. Maybe just keep it in my inventory for the chill resist. Yeah. Oh, I did it wrong. That yeah, got him anyway. It also occurs to me, I don't really have a ready solution to the cryomancer, do I? Yeah, look at that graphic. Look at the graphic for the elevator symbol. It's really jaggy. There's some... It's it's very aliased. It's anti-anti-aliased. It needs to be fixed, I say. So I think my solution for the Cryomancer will come in the form of... I can just aim and then automatically crit, right? And then just blow them the hell up. It's very useful on this challenge. Yeah, I should be aiming all the time with this it's critical 40, and then I aim, and then I should make uh, I already have aim assist. I already have a magic helmet. And what the, um, with the optimization for that uh, Army of Darkness brings. Mm, just zero damage, huh? So I can do 92 damage with a hit with an option of more. And it's not even with the frag shotgun. All right, this frightens me. I have to really investigate that, don't I? I will not be using the pistol amp. Ooh. Um. I suppose the best thing to do, huh? Wow, that's a lot of damage. So as I was saying... Uh-oh. Oh, that's mighty unfortunate. I was planning on just... That hurts. 
I was planning on just hucking the uh, uh, my gas grenade. Hi, friend. Apparently, I'm doing just fine. Just hacking the bits around corners. I have to say, this situation could be a little better. So, I do 147 damage right now. Huh. That's quite a lot of damage. I'm not sure what the math is on there. This is a wonderful relic. Better than vision? I don't think so. That's one of the relics I, I will use, even though it has a massive malice associated with it. Yeah, I'm way over, over everything, honestly. Especially if I'm going to have the frozen heart. So as I drop the small head kit for the large one. Look at the graphics. They're just alias to hell. There's something going on. Something's different. Different's bad. Oh. I very much enjoy being immune to cold. Cold is the worst of all of the... Ow. Status effects. It's the one that combos so very hard. I'm not sure this is really in the spirit of, of shotgunning. This is better. That's even more better. <laughs> Alright, so that wasn't hard at all. I want to say I have this in the bag, except uh, there's some new stuff in Dante. I may very well screw up. And... I guess I'm obliged to go for uh, the BFT, given I have uh... All right, maybe this wasn't the best idea right here. <laughs> All right, find a plasma shotgun. That's what we're doing. We want some. Hello, friends. Aiming really just wrecks him. Good. That's nice. That is the upside of shotguns right there. Occasionally you get to do that. Aim through, right? I do want a plasma shotgun, right? That thing. Maybe even the katana. Um, frag shotgun is frenzy. 50% damage against bleeding targets. Ugh, that's so good. Alright, anyway, here we have plasma shotgun. Get rid of my normal auto shotgun in favor of the plasma. I think maybe. Is the quick blade better? No, the quick blade is better for my purposes anyway. So, farewell to you, shotgun shells. Now we see how the plasma goes. Is this a good idea? Highly questionable. It's adaptive. 
Uh, not sure what to do with this, except not, not, not put it on uh, a shotgun. Because it is not needed. Don't need grenades. Do need ammo. Um, power mod for the Duramesh. So repair armor. Auto calibrate the plasma shotgun. Uh, charge. Create mod pack. Power pack. Put the power pack on the Duramesh for carrier. And I suppose for plasma shotgun, it's just, it's got to be power, power, power. Oh, yeah, look at the mod thing again. Jupiter Hell Wiki mods. Because I have no idea what to put on a shotgun. I mean, look here, shotgun is really weak for WizKid level 1. Point blank and ripper. Swap harness and loading harness. Like, auto loader comes later. God, all the mods here are just weak. Um, so I guess I do nothing, huh? I mean, I suppose I could put on point blank on the shotgun just to have point blank on the shotgun. I mean, what else am I going to put on there? Uh, charge, charge. Great mod pack power. Put the power pack on the shotgun for point blank. And I just aim. And just blow it to snot. Alright. Let's go. IO, right? IO, IO, look around, IO. I feel like I have this one at this point. I hear a lot of pain. It's never good on Nightmare. I may have been a little bit over-optimistic when it comes to my movement. Oh no! I didn't move. I wasn't supposed to do that. I, uh... I moved when I meant to aim. <laughs> Oops. I'm gonna have to come back this way almost certainly. So worry not. I'll get the opportunity and make this mistake again. Okay, good. Sneaking around. All these guys are gonna get back up. Sea Dravager. Ooh. Sea Dravager. Oof, that was a mistake. All of these things I'm doing right now are bad. Everything I just did there was a mistake. That was all a problem. Really bad play. Ah, uh, what do we got? Go to the black site? Because I have the helmet? Probably. What else is going on? Vault on the black site? <laughs> yeah, go to the black site. Am I actually doing plasma damage? I am. So, a big chunk of, uh... Oh, it didn't kill him because I'm so low on fury. Ah, I am playing like garbage right now. Get to fill up on this. So is the frag shotgun actually better right now? I think probably not. There's things coming after me. I 
they're awake. Well, at least those aren't awake. Now, all the guys that got killed at the beginning of the level are back up. At least those two are taken care of. The second time around, formers are not a problem. Okay, good. Just pick my way through here. Just passing through, guys. On my way to the black site. Don't mind me. Let's do this. Resilient. Do I see someone coming up behind me? Yes. Normally this would be a cause for panic, but I don't feel like panicking right now. Uh, running is good, rip and tear level 2 is, is what I need. That's to lean into the melee aspect of this. Meanwhile, What does Infernal do? Leaves a trail of fire, spines fallen away, fire immunity, cold affliction. That's good. I like that. Oh, that was probably a bad move. Probably should have chosen to do that to him and then quick blade him. Army of Darkness isn't all bad. Maybe two machete is bad. Well, that is bad. This is my exit. Good. Being able to deal with cry marines like that, definitely uh, recommended. Ouch. Attack visor? Absolutely not. You might be interesting. I'm more interesting in Carrier Duramesh. I'm lying to myself and everyone else. Alright, time to get out of here. So, we're doing alright, right? We're doing just fine. Overall, that could have gone a bit better, but, you know. Look around. Look around. Yeah. Fiend's head is so good. Being able to know these guys are coming. I think I hear a Medusa. Is that a Medusa? Yes, in fact, it's an Arched Medusa. How best to deal with my friend here? Um, oh. Toxic Reavers, still a bit of a problem. Where'd the Arch Medusa go? No, serious question, where'd it go? I guess I killed it? Must have got a crit, huh? Again, must have got a crit. It's so funny that arch producers are. Oh, cry assault. That's right. Uh... I have a lot of feelings about what's happening right now. But the 
shotgun. Yes. That's the sort of thing only a shotgun can do. Hmm. So I have to admit. Me just getting shot a bunch. I mean, a whole bunch. Oh, I thought I'd be able to one shot it. This is exactly what I needed. Precisely what I needed. Now the cry assault is happening, and um, oh, I am going to have serious problems maintaining body temperature. I am I did not wish to do this but I was forced to How many of these guys are there? I feel like I'm on the edge of being flanked and I don't know. <sighs> this room is cruel. <laughs> Oh my god. I have to I have to hide. What to do, what to do, what to do? Go back the way I came. Try to sneak around. I feel weak. All these guys are gonna get back up. Why am I here when the the Medusas are going to be spawning? Like right there. Oh, what to do here? Is this just time to go? I think it's time to go. <laughs> or maybe bait the Medusa? Oh, the answer was go. Yeah, the answer was get out. <laughs> What are you? Hunter Katana's just as good as the Quick Blade. Is better than the Quick Blade, actually. So the assault failed, unfortunately. Oh, and I'm being hunted. I gotta go. He says as he loots. Trade the smoke grenade for what's in that box. Oh no, wait, it's wounded. Lucky. Alright, it's time to go. Now it's time to go. Uh, scared. Scared am I is. I is, I is scared. We go now. Wait, is this a Medusa infestation? Alright, so I have all of the... If this is a Medusa infestation, I am in... Smoke is so useful.
got to be calibrated, yeah. Wish I had that hallowed mod. Come with me, friends. Feel my touch. Ouch. Of course, it's an arch reaver. Why is it moving so weird? This is just a reaver level, huh? An arch reaver level with that. So bad. Um, all right, so I gotta think about the future. Hellrunner always good. Running might be better though, uh, especially since I'm kind of in a melee sort of configuration. Um, two more ranks of a reloader would do. We have an impact. Another rip and tear. I don't think so. Let's let's continue with the I want to be melee theme. I. It doesn't seem fair because it isn't. That's nothing I care about. That'll come in handy eventually. This leads us to the way out. Is this? Rational. Should eat that last multi tool. This is just pleasant right now. Having a hammer I can pop. Oof. Might as well take out one, right? Now oh, the cry assault's coming. And I am probably gonna have to tangle with it to get out. Eat that, take that. I should not be heading away from the exit. What, what is this? Uh-oh. Um. What did I just pick up? Oh, I have to go all the way and hit the station? Oh no. <laughs> Look at all the corpses. Will you unlock it? It will not. I had to do it previously, I guess. That sucks. Oh well. This cry assault doesn't really have a lot of future, I think. Yeah. This one's got my scent. So let's try to get out of here. So where is the damage coming from in all this? So 92 damage. Where is that actually coming from? There's... Army of Darkness doesn't do a lot to me right here. Just puts it in optimal range. So 72 is probably 77 damage plus uh, the 20 from the amp. 
Yeah, that makes math right there. I'm really sad about missing that storeroom. Probably because I didn't have control last level. Oh well. Uh, pain is, my friends. Pain is. Oh, nice. <laughs> right here when I don't need it. Um, I feel like I don't really need much right now. I need a higher level station. Unfortunately, it is not that. Oh, I need that though. Yeah, this will eat multi tools. Uh, increase health, charge, charge, charge. Increase health. And then slip back. Uh, extract, extract, extract. There we go. This makes happy, right? This sparks joy. Mm, that does not spark joy. None of this sparks joy. I nailed a two shot in Arch Boosie, though. any difference. None of that means anything. It's just guard, I guess. Turrets. Everyone hates turrets. No one has ever once said, man, you know what this needs? More more Duramesh Scout armor. It's swift this time. Um, that's actually better. <laughs> But I have to be very quick. Swift, you might even say. Uh, charge, charge, create mod pack, power pack. Put that on that armor for carrier. And go back and back, run, 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 run. I should probably take the plasma grenade. Probably better than the smoke grenade, right? And that's where I have to end up. So over here is where I go. Definitely the right shot. So what do I have to give up to put this in my inventory? The gas grenade? Yeah. I can hack the turrets for free? I guess that's because of, uh... My helmet. Hack the turret for free is what I should really say. Ow. Right, time to do the black side vaults, right? So there's no reason not to. Saft. Oh, they didn't come pouring out after me. Has that bug been fixed? There's just a lot to appreciate right there. It's important to stand back and just observe sometimes as the bloody hunks splatter out. Can I get two of you? Okay. Do I take the. Oh, hello. Hello, wave dancer. I I think I have to take you, right? This is a sign. Frag shotgun. Go away. This looks shiny. So what do you do? Fire is a plasma wave with high giving potential that causes explosions. 
Huh. Is this what I want? Will this make me happy? Is my search finally over? I have no idea what the answer to these questions are, but I do know I'm going to try this out. Maybe I need more ammo. Okay. That's a, such a stupid thing to say. You always need more ammo. So everything I shoot blows up. <laughs> but is the reload time higher? The reload time seems to be... Or is that because I lost the... Uh, uh, that mod on the utility amp. Cry Blaster, always nice. And right here we have Mach 3. And the reason I came here, right, is not you. Chain gun. Chain gun is to manufacture a base item. Manufacture a chainsaw. That's why I'm here. Uh, manufacture a chainsaw. TTL Chainsaw 80 Pierce ah, with 20% damage on bio enemies, semi mechanicals, and then Army of Darkness is plus 50, and then, and then a little bit plus 100 chainsaw damage. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. Um, you know, let's dismantle. My katana. Get my chainsaw. Put this on. <laughs> and let's see if we ever have an opportunity to use it, yeah? And so, I guess I can make an AV visor once I'm done with this level because I, the command visor will no longer be of any use. Yeah, we'll see. What else can I do here? Uh, though I can't say that with authority. Because watch there be some uh, change in Dante, which requires red key cards now. Bump. I feel like I used to reload faster with the other gun. What did that text say? Should I have read? Was it a mistake to just go through life completely illiterate? Oh, I have running. Maybe I should invest in the uh, next level of... Uh, next two levels of... Loader. Crit system or shred capacitor? Oh, yeah, I could reload, uh, re, re roll. Uh, crit 25. This is an excellent little, little, uh, wow. If I go into more crit, this is a ton of damage. Or just flat damage, you know. I should probably get rid of focus mode. Instead, get uh, anything else really. More reload. I'm not going to be aiming a lot. So, what do I do right here? I don't need anything, do I? I don't think so. Pretty sure the cry assault failed. I'm taking too much time on this level. Are going back at all? Oh, it's unstable. Oh, really? Oh, well, it's like I just eat it then, right? That hurts. That was my fault. 
that's laying around. Right, so we go up to this, and then we try to charge, charge, charge. We want to re-roll basic item perk on the amp. Not focus mode, please. Speed reloader. Here, let's look at the mods. What do I want? Utility. Wiki life. And shotgun. Critical chance. Crit damage. I mean, this is just fine. Shotgun auto loader. Reload every step. That's nice. Yeah. Let's test you out. Yeah, that's just fine. Uh, right okay, I can look at that. I'm going to get the BFT, but I'm distinctly unsure if I'm going to take it with me. Like, I guess I could give up the plasma shotgun since I have Wave Dancer now. Wave Dancer, I think, uh, outdoes it by quite a lot. And if anything ever gets into melee and I can't wave, Let's do this. Uh, this is why I have a chainsaw, you know? Always know what purpose your equipment serves. So you will not be deceived. I've done that before, so I guess I take the, the BFT. Um, go get an AV3, oh, what are you? Oh, Kerberos's paw. Oh. Um, that's not the right relic for this run through, unfortunately. It's really fun. But I don't need every level to be a swarm level. Feels like I can give up the, the heart pretty soon. Chainsaw. No. Wave dancer skill in position number one. Plasma shotgun. Uh, the, the BFT is going to be picked up. It's gonna come to me. Hello, friends. I don't think I've ever seriously used Wave Dancer. It's always such a blessing when a unique that matches your build drops. Yeah, I figured that was the first time I was killing that thing. All right, excellent. Wonderful trip to the Cry Labs. All sorts of fun stuff. Let's go. Now we have to just clear this place out. Still have the Fiend's Head. Fiend's Head gains in value the more. Uh, farther you are. The farther you are in the game. Oh, is that a big Medusa? It absolutely is. Yeah, I suppose it was only a matter of time before I found one of these guys. Okay, run. Sneak out. Get out. Chainsaw. feels dirty. It is dirty. But it feels great, too. Ow! You know what? That was really pissy. You get one of these. Even though I should be trying to level my main gun.
Maybe I should have kept the crit uh, system. It was the source of a lot of damage. Yeah, I don't know. Doing just fine without it, I think. be with me. Um, so now I'm in the land of choices, right? Hellrunner, obviously good. Reloader, obviously good. Um, Rip and Tear gives more fury, obviously good. More running, obviously good. Wizkid, not as good as it used to be. Um... Skilled is good at this point. Um, everything's just low level good. Nothing like really spikes good. So I guess I go with Doctrine and say it's Hellrunner time. Speed will save. Wave Dancer should just be about level enough, right? Now here's the vault. Alright, so. Time for Doctrine, right? Running. Nice. Use running. Chainsaw is so good. Mach 2. Um, extract, 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 right? There's a lot of stuff. There's three stations on this level. Man, it's going to be so hard to keep... Uh, uh, the kills from the chainsaw. Charge, charge, charge. Increase my health. I should honestly take that helmet, right? Because I no longer need the other one. Yeah, it feels like it's going to be a mistake, though. Oh, an adaptive. Running. Running will save me. Not fast enough. Alright, we're done, right? Yeah, sure, we're done. I am going to need to get more levels of running, though. Not yet. Next level. Next level is something special. Um, can I do this? No. Should I have charged? Uh oh. That's bad. Because of burning six, that is bad. Chainsaw man. Nothing for it. I am very much on fire.
Wave Dancer, level up. What do you do? More damage. And just more damage. Let's probably look that up. Feels like it probably does more than that. Oh, it's a secure vault. That sucks because I just killed a Medusa outside of it. <laughs> well, crap. Well. Ow! That hurt. That really hurt. That's just a Cyveros. Not enough damage. Yuck. I guess that focus mode on the utility amp was doing more work than I was giving it uh, credit for. Turrets. Okay. Guess there's easy solutions for them. Shoot in the head. Fortunately, that happens. Hmm. I feel like the focus mode uh, was an unappreciated hero. But when they're all clumped together, apparently I do wonderful things. I mean, for me, not really for them. They probably have a decidedly different opinion on the experience. Hello, friends. Alright, that was bad. I so wish that... I, I gotta use the BFT. I have this thing for a reason, you know? That, that reason is those things. I'm doing this level in the absolute worst order. Because again, I have to go back and get the uh, secure vault. Excellent weapon. I need to find the terminal. Apparently I just can't find it, huh? Where is the terminal? Serious question, where is the terminal? It has to be right above me, huh? Well, that is... A very unfortunate observation. There's a reason why I leveled up. <laughs> I got all that extra health. It's the melee Medusas. Man, I took the worst path through this level. But, you know, made it. Uh, 
My prospects are not getting any better. Oh my god, double turned. Double turned again. I'm not sure that's legal. All enemies are constantly chilling. You slowly lose health. Yes. It's not that slow. It's not that fast. Now, uh... Hello, friends. Come to Jesus. Okay. Here I've got just stuff. It's frozen just by being... Yeah, this is... I hit myself with that. I wondered if it would, and I decided to test it. The answer is yes. Another, it's a nice Mark III. That's good. Uh, manufacture advanced armor, AV3 combat helmet, please. What is it? What did I get? Night vision? That's nice. That'll be very useful in the next level. Anyway, time to go. I have definitely overstayed my welcome. Uh, I have so many levels I need to get. Not as fast as I am. Okay. So I should be just be able to face roll all of this, right? I've got a slow death curse on me. But it is very slow. Strange, this is a it's good synergy with uh, AMF. Should I wish to get it? Being a cryo watcher is. It feels good. <laughs> You're not supposed to be a cryo watcher, but when you are one, it's nice. Fight is a lot different when he's constantly slowed. How is it always the last one? There we go. Um, Army of Darkness. Ah, uh, the ancient gun. Not what I need. Good, good, all this is good. Is that what I need? Is that what's going on? New, bigger Dante coming up. New levels. And that just had nothing in it. It's because that bug's still there, where if you... everything that respawns, respawns in the center. So I guess I better get more fury. Because all sorts of stuff's gonna spawn between me and the way out. Luckily, I don't have to dive. Don't have to dive. Ah, nice. I've got a bunch of plasma grenades. I should try to remember. I should try to remember I have a bunch of solutions to. Uh, the sort of problems this area might throw at me. Dante Station. I should probably get rid of the, the heart. Given that I'm not going to sacrifice it. Okay, this thing is scared. I'm not going to go into the abyss. 
Oh, remember I have night vision and they don't. That will lead to problems for them. Oh, don't melee with the shotgun. <laughs> don't melee with Wave Dancer. Uh, ossuary? What's the ossuary? That's something different. Something new. Do I need more? I don't think so. I've got army circles level 2. Do I need any grenades? I don't think so. Like, there's nothing really I'd give up except the frozen heart. And like, maybe there's cold in the future? I don't know. You can't see me. Wave Dancer level up. What do you get? So 90 plasma is pretty good. Where's the ossuary exit? Well. Is this anything I, uh, is this anything I care about? No. Good. What's that? Oh, it's a Dante ammo box. Do I need more ammo is the real question. Vision, the ultimate advantage. That's why Cat Eye was so good in Doom RL. Yeah, this is pretty comfy. This could be a lot worse. Oh. Can't see me. See how long that sends up. I mean, we have to go to the ossuary, right? There's no way we can avoid that, right? We must. We're being called. Let's go. What? Why can't I open it? Why can't I enter? The ossuary. I can't get into the ossuary. Oh, it's got the... There's some puzzle to get into the ossuary? Alright. I'll see what I can do about that. Three hundred and twenty. And it has it has more than that. Wow. Flowing blood reopens the portal. No, that's to the abyss. Will it also open the ossuary? No. Well how? How do I get in there? something, right? Kill everything? Everything? I can probably manage that. Just since I have a sight advantage. That is all of them, but how do I open up the ossuary? Huh. Well, if the, if the 
answer does not present itself forthwith. I might have to go look it up. Because what's the fun of being locked out of all of the fun? How do I get in there? Messages? Ah, assets and bots disappear. I start with a single one during the patrol, and now it's full patrols have gone missing. We're losing more assets than we're being able to send. Uh, you won't be hearing from me again. We're slowly setting a foreign camp aid. Minors have constantly happened. Morale is low. Communication falling on a regular basis. This place is cursed. Send more men. Morale is low. Patrols are reaching further and further into structure. We still can't pinpoint the last case, but this is definitely Jupiter. The last patrol found some windows and it seems outside. One is raised to our Boy, with scientific details. Well, how do I get into the ossuary? I have murdered all of the men's. On Nightmare, even. I'm looking around. Is there something I have to do? Something I have to blow up? No. Oh. I guess I had to kill everything. Alright, that's fine. The haunt will start. Oh, new tile set. Uh, not really afraid of the hunt. Frost Guardian, what are you? Um, I guess it does uh, chill damage, right? Only the problem with it is I'm immune to cold. Hmm. Well, not really a fan of being shot so much. Maybe I should get AMF. Ooh. I really just blow it up. That's big. What's bloodlust? 10% damage? Oh, why am I getting hit so much? Are they just kind of appearing? Should I be concerned about this? Especially on a hunt level, if they're just appearing from the outside. I should have tested to see if they were uh, giving XP. I'd brought a pure shotgun with me. Oh, the hunt is on. Is this tough reaver? No, this is of any concern. They're all bloodlusted. I mean, this doesn't bother me at all, right? Look at the move speed. Oh my god. Frozen and kneecapped. What? Plus 40% damage. I wonder why this is. Forty percent damage. Don't get hit, I guess. It would probably be terrifying if uh, I didn't slow them down. 50% damage, but look at this, move speed, 4 seconds. 
I feel my bloodlust rising. Okay, that's cool. Um, what else am I doing? Probably running too. Huh. So I killed them all. Oh, I probably have something, don't I? Uh, I feel my bloodlust rising. I don't have anything on my character sheet. No, I'm in a branch. Keep that in mind. So whatever happens probably happens way at the end. The hunt was nice. Always enjoy the hunt. Just like it. Simple as. Didn't enjoy all those floaty things. Um, Ossuary level 2. Alright, cool. Kill them all. Remember I can go melee at any time. Okay, not a big fan of this. Big open area like that. That's an onslaughting kind of layout. Why does this look like an arena? This feels very arena-y to me. Love the new tile set. It's adaptive. Don't like that. Well, okay. For this, we have a special cure. Oh, Arch Medusa, and it's bloodlusted. That's a problem. But freezing it has benefits. Sweep quickly. Glad I got uh, that point of Hellrunner. Glad I have the frozen heart on me. Kind of want to take the stim pack in exchange for more energy cells. Let's walk between the barrels. Abattoir? get the feeling I should not go there until I've cleared this level. Definitely going to the abattoir though. No friends. What level of bloodlust are we at? Hmm. Now, I heard there was a new boss. And if I was a new boss, I would be... Ooh. Uh, running chainsaw. I would be right in there. Because where else would I be, honestly? Damn it. <laughs> Funny. Wave Dancer did all that. stuff in the way. And then I did it to myself. Let's use some more health. Damage 150. Oh, and it didn't even do it. Oof. Super nail gun again. There's a bunch of these floating off there that I have to hunt down. Because that would suck. Alright, 
got dots. It is going to take some shooting to put them all in the graves. Luckily, I'm what you call a shooting man. Bloodlust is rising. Let's see. Nothing on the sheet. Hmm. Alright. So my bloodlust is rising. I agree. Um, let's go get those cells. Never know when I'm going to need them. Abattoir, we got. Okay, ominous. Love the new pillars. And the floating ones. Okay, definitely a boss room. The Butcher. Delirium is 100%. What do we have here? He's not that fast, he's worth a lot of experience. He's not resistant to cold. I have brought his only weakness to bear. <laughs> well, that sucks. Melee does a ton of. Damage reduction resistance bonus based on range. Huh. Alright. So let's kick it off by running. So, I, is this just a melee fight? <laughs> boop, boop. Uh, so yes, it was just a melee fight. Uh, running level three. Um, nice graphic though. So he, it's he has a shield based on how close you are to him, and he wants you out in the open, and he probably has some sort of ranged attack to hurt you. And so it's about dodging and baiting him close to the pillars if you're ranged, or if you're melee, just go up and hit him. But I suppose if you, the thought is, if you're melee, why are you here? If you're melee, why didn't you go get Soul Stealer? What is that? It's the floor? I don't know. Unknown device. Present push broken symbol. Present weapon. Two charges. Step away. Present. Oh, I can feed it an item? Or I can push a broken symbol. Should I give it the BFT? I think I'm going to give it to BFT. What do we got here? Oh, good. I need that. What we got right over here? Circle symbol. Triangle symbol. Elixir symbol. Present advanced item. Step away. Huh. Unknown device. Press blood symbol. Heart symbol. Present frozen heart. Alright, let's do it. What just happened? I'm in pain. Blessings of power. 10% damage dealt. I mean, that's that's great. Is that what I got? I guess that's what I got. Okay, I suppose. Um, I... Still got three charges, huh? Blood, herb, and heart. All right, let's press the heart symbol. That just gave me a boost of... Uh, health as per normal. Can I charge you? No. Alright, so over here on this machine it implies I can present an advanced or exotic item. I'm going to give it the BFT. 
take this. Take select the item to add slots to. Ooh. Present weapon. Push broken symbol. Push portal symbol. I don't know what I did. I pushed the portal symbol. <laughs> I do like the theme of this. That is such a weird item to find here. I suppose it's gone now. It's a gap. So I push the portal symbol. Now here, push the elixir symbol, push the circle, and then the triangle. Ancient mod pack. That's wonderful. And Cryvorosis Fang. Now that's the ancient leg graph right there. The ancient leg graph's wonderful if I want to actually be melee. Oh, I'm bleeding to death while I'm doing all this, right? Ancient mod pack on the chainsaw. <laughs> that's... That's an item. Um, anyway. I suppose I am bleeding to death while I'm poking around in here, but I can't help it. Maybe it stops now that everything's dead. Why am I so fast? Why am I so fast? My move speed is extremely fast. Why is that? Huh. Oh, I picked up the leg wrap. Oh, okay. I did get rid of, uh... Huh. Oh, it gave it to me, and it pitched out. Oh, it's the, it's, that's the only way you could possibly... You, you can ever drop a relic, right? Eh, I like everything being slow around me. I'll take bleeding to death as a consequence. I pushed the portal symbol, though. What do you suppose that means? Hello, Butchor. What did the portal symbol mean? Did it do something? I definitely feel like I'm missing something. No, I'm bleeding to death. I don't really mind. This is in cause of science, and yeah, I guess. Push the broken symbol. Did it give me something? Is there something in my inventory? Oh, the portal gave me an ancient phase kit. That's alright. There's nothing wrong with that. Alright. I feel satisfied. That was fun. <laughs> the butcher was, um, uh... I understand why the butcher is here. Usually a character in... of my persuasion would, uh not take this route. Here we are. I made my choices. We all have to live with... Yeah. These guys are pretty tough. Ooh, I can auto-calibrate something. They're incredibly useful. It really is the ultimate pack clearing weapon. Well, okay. That would be the BFT. 
This is really just a very, very solid pack clearing weapon. Like that. How much more fun can you get? I would like to su suggest not a lot more fun. Auto calibration, the chainsaw. I really have to use that more. Like right now, let's go. Running. Uh, 240. I miss. 838 damage incoming. I miss. Wow. I'm not really sure that was worthwhile. Maybe not the best way to play when taken into real scientific accountability. When you start doing the measurements and consider all the options and the uh, opportunity costs, probably wasn't the most efficient use of resources. But that's not why we're here. Uh, running chainsaw. Chainsaw. Hallowed chainsaw will lead the way. The ha chainsaw of the Lord. And on the third day the angel spoke unto the people, and they said, Take unto you the chainsaw and sever all of the enemies of the Lord. And it was good. Alright, so we're pretty much unstoppable, right? Unstoppable whirlwind of destruction. Dante Alter. Nothing I need to care about right here. We're just gonna go chainsaw stuff, right? Our holy, hallowed chainsaw. Hello, running. I am in a lot of pain. No, I am not. He's withered, and so he's just doing, just in horrible condition. Minions, where are you? Minions! Ah, there's the minions. I want to go speak to them. They too need to know of the chainsaw. Yeah! Interesting how the um, the the, um, the pits are different. It's a white light. I wonder why. Anyway, um, so that was fun. Greatly appreciated the new level. The new boss was um, maybe not as threatening as he might be. Um, yeah, it's just. The mechanic is you've got to get close to him in order to blow him up. Uh, any melee is going to have great fun with that. Um, what else do we got? Explorer and Ossuary Nails. Killed the boss. Yeah, that wasn't that tough. Um, maybe it would be with, like, entrenchment or something. You have to bait him close somehow. Yeah, I don't know. Um, what to say? Uh, shotguns, good, better, definitely better, good enough, I am not convinced. Army of Darkness remains one of the weaker masteries, uh, mainly because the first three traits you have, the three traits you have to get early, meaning Reloader, Furious, and the first level of Army of Darkness are really quite weak. Uh, they all go into, like, Furious does nothing, it just doesn't exist, it's just a, a sunk point. Reloader and the first level Army of Darkness deal with specific problems with the shotgun, meaning it's bad against bots. Army of Darkness fixed that. And then um, 
reloader helps with the the very bad DPS over time. Um, so all it does is like go to patch the weapon up into something you can use. Now I'm not going to render any firm judgments right now. I need to play a normal shotgun game to see how it works into you know playing a ghost game, ghost with shotguns or something like that. You know. Um, before I can really give a firm uh, conclusion. But I will do more research. Uh, so what else? Um, obviously damage was never the issue. The slowdown combined with the major relic absolutely crippled everything in the ossuary. You saw that one reaver with the four second movement time. That is just sad. <laughs> The saddest Reaver you ever did see. Um, so, like, I need to withhold judgment on shotguns. Obviously, they brought the pain just fine, but this was nightmare difficulty. It's not the hardest game you could possibly play. Um, I'll have to test it in uh, Inferno difficulty at some point, though not with Army of Darkness. Army of Darkness is... Well, the other half of Army of Darkness is that you have to... So many required traits. Maybe I didn't need Army Surplus. I would just have to give up not ever using shotguns until I got a plasma uh, shotgun. But then Army Surplus 2 just flooded me with ammo from all the boxes. It's so good. I mean, it's two points, and I hate investing in ammo. But still, it does the job. So it's you can't complain that much. Um... Even early on, I brought the shotgun into the mines, thinking this is just going to be suicide. And in previous games, it would be suicide, but I think the slowdown really did help. So, definitely improved. Though, I, it, again, I have a hard time separating the slowdown from investing in a point of reloader, which I would normally never do. So, more research needed. I think what I'm going to do next probably the gauntlet. I don't think there's any way they can keep me from the gauntlet. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to do the gauntlet. I'm also really curious what the buttons in the ossuary do. I'm going to have to look it up eventually. But the portal button gave me a phase kit. The blood button gave me a uh, health boost. Uh, no, the heart button gave that. Don't know what the blood button does. Maybe just a heal. Um, bringing, it was nice to have another use for the heart. I wasn't even expecting that. Um, I got the heart because I really like the ruins, because it can give me a hallowed pack. And I guess there's another chance for a hallowed pack in the avatar, but why would you need it at that point? I wonder, I probably should have paid attention to how much hit points the boss had. It was, uh... Huh. <laughs> that wasn't the best showing from a new boss right there, I tell you that. So, I've been at this for a very long time. I'm going to wrap it up. Uh, for anyone who watched all the way through this, thank you very much. And I'm definitely going to play more. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye-bye.